Hey, how's it going? Well, I just got done watching another music video. Uh, I'll leave a link to it in the description bar. Mentioning a lot of problems uh, in this country. But then near the end, it started saying, oh, equity, not equality. And to my knowledge, that essentially means the whole equality of outcome model. And it's just like... <sighs> Everything that's pushing against, well, not everything, but the majority of what's pushing against uh, racism in this country is pushing for this equality of outcome model. I don't know whether our system could handle that. I don't, I, I, I've, in the past, I've just said it can't handle it, you know, but... You know, just flat out, it can't, it's going to fall apart. And I'm just going, well, what if it could handle it? You know, what if my initial judgment on it is wrong? What if it could handle it? I certainly, I think hiring and firing and uh, getting housing based on, uh, uh, you know, trying to create some equal demographical thing uh, or, or using a... Uh, uh, the progressive stack to to make decisions. I think I I think it's a terrible idea. But um, I mean, if it was looked at as a temporary until things seem more evened out, you know. But it's not looked at that way. It's just like no, this is this is the way that things should be. And I'm like, well, you know, what would happen to jobs? Would would we have to dumb down jobs more? Because there'd be people that are being hired that aren't actually fully qualified for it? Or am I just pulling it, am I doing a slippery slope argument in that? You know, could our system actually handle this sort of thing? You know, I have my serious doubts, but maybe it could work. I'm just trying to think about if uh, if movements continue as they are and they gain some sort of momentum and start getting things happening into law, you know, down the line. Could we handle something like that? What would happen if that started being applied to the government as well? Now... In the sense of the government, I could see that a lot more than I could the pri you know private industry. But you know, um, that would be interesting because it well it is it is a fact that uh, this country is pretty much ran by old white men. So anyway, hey, mostly mostly, and I'm not saying I don't get me don't. Uh, take that as if I'm saying that oh, all, all old white men in, in uh, uh, that are in office right now are racist. I, I'm not saying that. Although I've already stated that I think everyone is racist and we have to just work hard to, to get past those natural tendencies because we all you know, it's it, xenophobia is something that uh we naturally have as a as it's a defense mechanism uh, from our past. It was what we needed to do to survive in the past, but we don't need that anymore, but we still have it left over. So we have to fight against that. So I guess I'm rambling. Main thing I wanted to say is, you know, or ask is, can we handle if equality of outcome was actually implemented?